Hello everyone, welcome to the second unit of our science lesson. In this unit, we will be focusing more on matter. Our objective for today's lesson is to explore the fastest way to cause ice to change to water by planning and conducting an investigation. What causes ice to melt? Watch as the water drips from these icicles. What causes the ice to become liquid water? Heat from the sun causes the icicles to warm up and melt and return to their liquid state as water. Water can be a solid and a liquid, which are both states of matter. Water turns into solid in the absence of heat, which are in the form of snow or ice. During winter, in some countries, we see snow everywhere. It could be on the ground, branches of trees, or on the roof of a house. But when warm sunlight appears and reaches the snow, it starts to melt. Hence, icicles are formed. This looks like ice are dripping off of roof of a house or branches of trees. When does ice melt? Our normal body temperature is 37 degrees Celsius. If the number goes way down, it is due to the absence of heat. Zero degrees Celsius is the freezing point. Now take a look at these glasses. On the first glass, it is filled with ice cubes. The temperature is 5 degrees Fahrenheit or negative 15 degrees Celsius. After some time, the ice begins to melt because it is adapting to the room temperature. We can assume that the room temperature is not cold enough to keep up with the temperature of the ice cubes. The third glass has the same temperature like the second one because of the ice cubes. And the last glass, all ice have completely melted and has a temperature of 33 degrees Fahrenheit or 0.5 degrees Celsius you would notice that the number changed due to the absence of ice. It means that this last glass is no longer as cold as it was before. Always remember that ice starts to melt with the presence of heat. That's all for today. Thank you.